know, Frisco, I'd offer you a job in my warehouse. Okay, any open. You know something, Sean? I truly believe you would. But it just seems that everybody else doesn't want to cop on the premises. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah. No, no sense in sitting around feeling sorry for myself. I gotta find some work. Hey, look, why don't I give you a loan for the duration? Thank you for the offer, but I'll work for my living. I don't want to borrow. Hey, come on. We're friends. Don't stand on ceremony. Please. Listen, Felicia and I really were going to be just fine as soon as I make some more cash. Anna really has you in a bind. Well, the way I look at it, Sean, it takes two. I mean, I walked right into the suspension. I mean, well, look at yourself, right? You're not in too great a shape with her. She's still leaning on you about Alan Quatermain's death, right? Yeah, but it's been quiet the last few days. Always puts up a funk with me. I mean, she knows I didn't kill Alan, despite her evidence. If this whole thing is a setup, I just don't know who the hell set me up, that's all. You guys should be working together to find out. Oh, yeah, that'd be great. At least Robin still loves me. Oh, by the way, I'm taking her to lunch. Why don't you join us? Oh, that'd be great. I've been neglecting her so much lately. Yeah, I'd like that. Yeah, I'm we'll gonna pick her up at Anna's office. You want to tag along? Ah, no. No, I have no reason to walk right into the lion's den. You go ahead. Anna really has you intimidated. See you later at lunch, okay? Good morning. Damon, Good Felicia. Morning. Well, it was nice running into you. I have to get back to my desk. We had something we were going to propose to your boss, remember? So what would that be? Well, it was just an idea, but if you're busy right now, we can talk about it later. Well, I think we should make our proposal right now. It seems that Felicia's husband has been looking for work down in the docks without a lot of success. Now, from what I've heard, Frisco's a terrific singer. Yes, you've heard correctly. Frisco has quite a following here in Port Charles. Well, why let his talent go to waste? I'm not following you. You've got the club. You've got the stage. Yeah, I also don't have any entertainment for next week. Then how about hiring Frisco? Yeah, well, I'd like that, but will Frisco show up this time? Oh, yeah, thanks. <laughs> I guarantee you would, but, um... I know this is a great opportunity, but next week will be too late because his suspension would be lifted. Well, in other words, he's only available this week. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry. This is a disappointment. Well, I wish I could do something to help out, but already I, I have entertainment for this week, and I cannot break the contract. Yeah, I understand. <sighs> we tried. Thanks. Um, we better look at those raffle books. I just got in from the printer. If you'll excuse me, I'll be downstairs. Maybe you ought to get a shave, huh? He said it. I didn't, Duke. The hit is guaranteed. Well, I still haven't got the solution. I do. I've got your controlled environment for you. You'll have to work fast. Eddie Cray is the name of the singer that's uh, singing at Duke's Club. Now, you make sure that Eddie Cray gets a case of laryngitis so he can't perform tomorrow night. Are you with me? Well, where are we headed? You get a waiter's job at the club. Me, a waiter? Well, I happen to know they're hiring extra help today. Business is booming. Uh, what's this got to do with Frisco Jones? Frisco will be the replacement for Eddie Cray tomorrow night. The club will be packed to capacity. Need I say more? Perfect. You should have no trouble making your hit, Mr. Price. getting married? <laughs> Wait, I didn't tell you my mommy's getting married, too. Your mom's oh. getting married? That's a blast. <laughs> oh, gosh. Nobody's letting me finish. All right, everybody. Please, let Robin have the fart. Okay, kid, you're on. Bum, 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 boom. Okay. My new daddy's going to be Duke. Duke Lavery? Mm hmm Yes. I have new daddy to live with me. 
Well, when did Duke pop the question? Well, he didn't do it yet, but I know he will. Don't get too excited about this wedding just yet. Well, Mommy's buying a new dress, and she's going to lunch with Uncle Duke. So you'll see. So you think today's the day, huh? That Duke's gonna ask your mommy to marry him? For sure. So where do you think Mommy and Duke are going for their honeymoon? Do you think they'll go to Disneyland? Disneyland? Why Disneyland? Because I've never been there. Oh, uh, no, honey, I doubt it, Phil. I want you to go along on the honeymoon. <laughs> you see, uh, your mommy and Duke would want to go uh, alone. That's what honeymoons are for, for people to be alone. Like me and Felicia, when we went on our honeymoon, right? We... <laughs> remember the first night that we were on Alan Quartermain came in and busted us? You remember that? That's right. That's probably when Alan got a hold of that Mexican pottery cup of mine. What are you talking about? Sweetheart, you are a real gem. Thank you for jogging Frisco's memory in mine. You just helped me answer a question I've been looking for. Oh! That's part of that setup I was telling you about. Go to Anna's office and fill her in. Wait, my mommy's not at her office. She's with Duke, remember? Oh. Remember? Yeah, I remember. Okay. Felicia. Yeah. Could I see you for one minute, please? Okay. Our singer, Eddie Cray. Mm -hmm. Well, he seems to be a little under the weather. I was wondering perhaps if Frisco could help me out and maybe fill in here beginning tomorrow evening. Oh, that's perfect timing. Do you think he can handle it at such short notice? <laughs> short notice is better than no notice at all. See, small miracles can and do happen, Felicia. Yes, they do. Can you give me Frisco's answer as soon as possible? Okay, I'll talk to him tonight and I'll give you a call. Well, actually, I would have to know sooner, and I'm sure he would appreciate the rehearsal time. Oh, yes. Uh, could he rehearse here at the club? Well, I'd be nervous if he didn't. You can tell Frisco that the stage is his immediately. Okay. I'll go look for him right now, okay? Okay, thank you. Thank you. Here, keep it all. Keep the rest. Hey, Sean. <laughs> what? Here. Oh, come on. Are you kidding? No, on. I should buy you a brand new car today. You're reminding me that Alan showed up on your honeymoon night. Are you kidding me? Come on. I've got good news. Hi, honey. Hello, son. Oh, Hi. good. Hello, honey. Hi. I have lots of news, too. Oh, could I hear my good news first, please? I really need to hear some, okay? What is it? It's all right. He wants you to fill in for his singing act tomorrow night. He'll do it. It'll make up for all of your lost wages. I'll come see you, St. Frisco. Did you say tomorrow night? You can sing and practice at the club all as much as you want. Could I get a word in here, please? Of course. Tomorrow? Now, how am I going to get an act together by tomorrow night? You can do it. Of course you can do it. I can? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Good idea. We'll see you later. All right. Bye-bye. Bye, Frisco. Bye. Bye. All right, everything seems to check out. You ready for a long rehearsal? Oh, uh. Talk about timing. Can you believe this good luck? I think it's wonderful the way things worked out for everyone. Thanks again for going to bat for Frisco this morning. First one. Hello. Let's do this one for my lovely wife. thinking of a, another song, another uh, old song. You always hurt the one you love. <laughs> Don't go on a guilt trip. How else were you going to protect Anna? Too bad Anna doesn't understand. God knows I would tell her if I could, but I can. 
Where did you find that waiter? Uh, we hired several new ones. I don't know who interviewed him. He looks awfully familiar. I've seen him somewhere before. I gotta go out here. I wanna go fresh air. You want company? No. Nah. I'll go my own. All right. the whole number you don't want to take any chances at all with a lighter okay let's do the whole thing from the top all right david four two three four Baby, be mine, baby, be mine, be mine tonight. You go that way. 